Alright, we're checking out the only game where as my star level goes up, my will to live goes down. It's GTA. So Alex wanted to do whatever he wanted for the different star levels, so he created a brand new challenge. One, two, three stars, it's all gone. Now it goes up to 5,000 stars. Alex has created a bunch of new challenges and checkpoints that I have to navigate through while getting to the end and try not to get elbow dropped by God himself. Let's do this. Welcome to prison. Level one. Oh, we're starting at five stars. Great. Now, on each instance, there's different abilities that are going to be on the wall. Oh, there's a helicopter. Dro Whoa, <laughs> Where'd the gun come from? Inmates want to stab you. A bounty on your head. News team follows you. Okay, so they've given me a gun and a motorcycle that ended up murdering the guy that was supposed to escape with me. Bro, you're not taking my motorcycle. This is 100% here for me. Also... <sighs> You don't want to be on this motorcycle, man. I know the Alex challenges. Don't do it. Go away. Let me put my helmet on because I'm sure I'm going to need it. Okay, so effectively how this works. It... Okay, narrating this while not getting mugged is going to be... Did I just get stabbed in the spine? How come everyone in this prison has a knife? What do they give them out at lunch or something? I'm also getting shot by the guards and it's pretty difficult to drive. While I'm getting, while the news crew is <laughs> me around. Okay. How am I supposed to get out of here without getting sniped? All right. Clearly I have to fight back because if I don't, I just die immediately. Look up and smile. I'm not smiling, Alex. I am in fact frowning a lot. I found the one spot in the entire prison where everyone doesn't shoot me with high powered rifles. Anyway, if you get out here, <laughs> If you get out here, there's actually a giant arrow if you know it is. Hold on, I'm trying to take care of this so I don't get shot while I'm directing you to the arrow. Oh my god, they're everywhere! As I was saying, there's a giant arrow if you know it is over to our right. Oh god. And that will bring us to the next level of the wanted meter, which I don't understand how things could get much worse. At oh, just make hey, the bad man stop. Oh, this is pretty good. Uh, the Woo! <laughs> Almost pulled back a little bit too far. Did it? Was it just me, or did the did the helicopter drive into the side of a mountain? Right, hundred percent. Somewhere over here, there, there it is. Okay, somewhere over here, I was gonna say there is. Did I just murder a bunny or something? What's with all the different vehicles kind of wandering around? You can see them every once in a while. They're here. Okay, so there is a checkpoint. So once I get this, at least we can start from this point in the challenge. How many stars are we going up to? He just. Checkpoint! Ten stars, road blockades, army, helicopter, mercenaries are after you, second amendment. Like, I'm gonna get bludgeoned with the second amendment? Oh. So I've been given a lot more guns, I guess. Ow. Did I just get shot? Seriously? I'm not gonna lie, this isn't that bad. Like, now at least I can duck down and kind of have some cover. And I have a doom buggy instead of, you know, a motorcycle that just shouts, kill me, please. Hey, special delivery. What is that? Oh! Oh! Okay! I guess that's the army helicopter! Uh, the army helicopter is no joke. Like, I died almost immediately. Actually, you get to see me die very slowly. How many helicopters am I going to be dealing with? Oh, there's a guy sitting on the edge of that helicopter. I'm gonna try and drive my way out of here, but every time I've gotten inside of this vehicle- There is a gun on the front, so that's good. The only problem is I can't drive and use the gun at the same time. I think what's amazing right now, if you've noticed to the right, ready? <laughs> I got to throw a grenade right as the, the the news helicopter turned on, so it gave it a really... Oh my god, hold on. Okay, so those are the road blockades that he was talking about. I've got all of the pipe bombs and molotovs and guns and pistols. My biggest issue at the moment is that... There's just not much armor in this thing. So if I take any shots, nothing's going to be blocking it. Don't mind me. Just resting right in the middle of a gigantic police roadblock. Nothing to see here. I can't believe no one shot at me. They're like, Gray wouldn't do anything felonious. Oh, really? I love how the one police cruiser was just parked on the- Oh, God. It was just parked on top of the roadblock. It was just sitting on top of a gigantic concrete pylon. Now, right up here, yeah, right there. See it in the left is where the arrow is. I can actually see it when I originally got inside of the buggy. It looks like the direction that you get inside of the vehicle shows you where the arrow is. 
Sorry! Oh, that was an innocent bystander. He had nothing to do with the challenge. I feel kind of bad about that. Well. Uh, I kind of got pit maneuvered. In the best way possible, and the reason why I say that is because the ceiling of the buggy was effectively protecting my cranium. I'm not gonna lie, that, oh, this thing's not very fast. The arrow is a lot farther away than you think. It's like the mirrors where it's like, oh God, no! Ah! I have no idea how I survived this. I am, I think it's because there's a guy stuck behind me and he's taking all the damage. So technically they don't get to hit me, but I also can't. Never mind, I'm on fire now. Hello, buggy. We're going to be seeing each other a lot. I hate your roadblocks. Oh, this this military helicopter. All right, here's the plan. I've got to put as much distance between me and that blue helicopter as possible because the thing has like aimbot attached to it. It kills me in a, a couple of shots. Oh, it is following me very viciously. I'm wearing like uh, I'm wearing like military helicopter cologne. Ode de violence. Just another day in GTA of me hating Alex's scripting prowess. You know what would be great? If some of these windmills protected me. Okay, I've been through a lot because of these windmills. Why can't they help a brother out? Stop it! Whoa! That was actually kind of cool. Oh no! I'm gonna have to pick a different vehicle or I'm gonna burn to death. Sorry, man. Oh my God! <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Really sorry. Hey. Girl, oh, she's on fire. She is burning alive right next to me. I am probably responsible for that. You guys are tasing me? This is a real thing that's happening? You're chain tasing me? Are you kidding me? I got tased to death. Okay, things are working out really good. Also, I hate to tell y'all, I just ran over a deer a little bit ago. I felt really bad about that, but I'm still alive. I'm using the traffic as kind of protection because the helicopter can't really shoot me with all the pedestrians in the way and it's pretty far behind me now. Also, how come just a random vehicle exploded out of nowhere? I've taken this time to become really good at throwing sticky bombs at people while going incredibly high speeds. At this point in this challenge level, this is the furthest I've managed to get because it, I had to, I had to escape. Oh, okay, oh, what is that? Why? Making TV from anything since 74. Oh, whoa! Yeah, that's what happens, man. That's what happens. No joke, I just got run over by a soccer mom. I'm trying to do a challenge. I just got run over by a lady going to the store to pick up milk, eggs, and overpriced toilet paper. Get out of the way! All right, jump through this, through the... Are you kidding me? You put glass in front of the TV? Let me have this! The glass responds! All right, I have an idea. Here's the plan. I'm gonna keep the sticky bomb on there and I'm gonna detonate it just as we go over the ramp. Okay, I've been trying to complete this for a while. I got abused by every cop in the tri-state area. Explode through the glass and now finally we have a checkpoint. What else are you going to make me do? A hundred stars! Bounty hunter, buzzard helicopter, cops use heavy weapons, covert kamikaze units, and citizens try to stop you. Great. Although I do have a really sweet ride. I don't understand why, but there is an exploding helicopter just over to my right, and it is very violently exploding, like just randomly exploding. Oh, it's shooting rockets at me. Of course it is. Also, I think this I think this car can jump. Okay, there's the arrow. I was trying to find out where the arrow is. It's like it's in the direction where when you start with your vehicle. I just didn't see it the first time. So the jump is there. I do have the jump. We've got saw blades on all parts of the vehicle. I think there's a gun and this should have some kind of cannon too. It's got the mortar in it, I think. Uh also, things are just randomly exploding around me. Is that the kamikaze? Yeah, this is all the time. There's just explosions what? like everywhere. There was a woman inside of this car. What is going on behind me? Oh, it's the, it's the rockets from the helicopter. <laughs> oh my God. No joke. I love, whoa. I love how the rockets are exploding like just behind my vehicle, like an epic action movie, how they never really aim for the protagonist. They aim just behind him. The fact that I'm still in one piece and not dead makes me. 
Mm. All right, I thought I could hang around and have some fun in this thing. I was wrong. We got to get out of here and just get to the checkpoint. Like, it's... Where did that rocket come from? There's no angle where that... Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, I, I got to start using the mortars now. Did you give all of the cops rocket launchers, Alex? No joke, I think every single cop has a rocket launcher right now. Oh, the blades on the front of this thing. I'm gonna ride that to victory, and the ride is not going to be very silky. It's gonna be filled with abusive rockets, the helicopter is right on top of me. Okay, there's the, what was that? I was gonna say, there's the arrow. I think he's throwing more than one rocket at me too. Sometimes the rockets, it's like 20 of them just explode. Excuse me. I'm just mortaring everything. Just everything I can see. It doesn't really blow anything up. It just kind of makes it flip, but whatever. That's good enough. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I love how all of the vehicles look like they're allergic to my car. Did you notice that I almost got smashed? Hold on. Ow! I was going to say, I almost got smashed by a rocket launcher. There is just rockets everywhere. This is such a mess. No, I was trying to get the checkpoint. I'm just trying to open it. Here we go, here we go. Okay, here we go, here we go. And jump, bail, checkpoint! I died, but I got the checkpoint. A thousand stars! All citizens attack you. Cops have more armor. Kang members are after you. Heavy army is an Apache helicopter. And now the citizens use heavy arms. I'm assuming now just everyone gets rocket launchers, both the citizens and the cops. But also I get this sweet car. Okay, so there's our next arrow. Get ready for the glitchy insanity of a lifetime. Oh, that's the Apache. All right, that's kind of cool. Okay, so I have rockets now and the mortars, and this car has pretty good armor. There's the Apache. All right, if I stay under like the bridges and stuff like that, the Apache probably can't do much to me. If the Apache, oh wow, there are gang members everywhere. Out of the way. If the Apache starts, oh God. If the Apache starts going underneath all the bridges, I'm gonna have a real issue. How much armor did you put on the Apache? Oh, this gun's amazing. Oh, I don't care how many stars there are. This is great. Oh, and the mortar is the explosive cut. What is that? Oh, wow. Was that an airstrike? <laughs> I think one of the, oh, the citizens are driving at my vehicle now. I was trying to understand what it meant when it was like, you know, the citizens are after you. I think every once in a while, they're trying to run me off the road. That was a total headshot. I spun, I did like a 360 that looked awesome. And now my skin is sliding off of my body. You know what would be great, Alex? You know what would be great? Less stars. That'd be wonderful if we could. Can I trade some of my stars in? Can I give? Can I give the? Can I give this Apache a bribe? Okay, because now instead of dealing with aimbot guns, I'm dealing with like aimbot rockets. Ooh, jump! The Apache's following me, but it actually hasn't shot a single rocket at me in quite a while. All right, so if I go up this area, and then whoa! Okay, never mind. It is starting to shoot rockets at me. If I go through this area, the arrow is right up here, so... Are you kidding me? Oh, I'm doing a handstand. That's great. Look at that, everyone. My neck is very flexible. Oh, boy. All right, we're just gonna cra- Well, all right, I guess I can do that, too. Did that helicopter just crash into a tree? Ow. A door from an exploding vehicle just hit me. Okay, the Apache is literally right behind me. I have basically, why is this whole area filled with like, like burn? Oh my God. I think he had it programmed to have rockets going at that fire escape because it was just filled with explosions and we have a checkpoint. Welcome to 5,000 stars. There's more cops, there's drone strikes. Of course, tanks are deployed. Jesus is deployed. And then there's a warthog. It's Jesus. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, oh, I got a guy. Sweet. Ow. Did you see the warthog, by the way? It's like bright green. Oh, and the warthog has some serious firepower because this thing has a ton of armor and I'm already taking a lot of damage. I love how the pet is. 
the guy on the top is not shooting anything. I love how he's just there to absorb bullets. He's like a bullet sponge. Everyone's attacking him. Oh, this is gonna be ridiculous. Even through this vehicle, I'm dead. All right, insurgent. Give, oh my God. Oh. Wow. I'm gonna be seeing this screen a lot. I love how the more stars you get, the less your life expectancy is. Oh, wow. I didn't get past where the previous vehicle got blown up. You have one job, head. Get up there, use the, all right, you know what? Yeah, just hang on the side of the vehicle, why not? Oh, we did get up there, just took a while. Okay, uh, we are not staying on top of anything, because if we do, we just get rocketed immediately. It is just a non-stop barrage of rockets behind me and guns. They may very well be rocket guns, I don't know. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Use the bridges. They can't get you under the bridges. It is raining fire. It is literally raining fire from the amount of rockets that Warthog is shooting at me. Oh God, no, no! The Warthog is kind of smart too. Like when I get under a bridge, you see it flying over me, you can see it. You can see that it tries to maneuver so that it can get a good shot at me. What's the AI programming on this Warthog? Oh boy, the Warthog is taking evasive maneuver so it can go around the building. There's a Warthog, the Warthog is drifting. 100% the Warthog is drifting. Warthogs don't drift. I love how eventually I'm gonna have to deal with Jesus. Why can't Jesus be like a buddy of mine? You know, someone that helps me out or something. <laughs> how did the Warthog get over here? All right, we're doing pretty good so far. Well, pretty good, we're still alive. Okay, we're really close to the arrow, very close. And there's a lot of buildings in this area, so that can intercept a lot of the explosions. Unfortunately, we're still dealing with all of the cops. Stop getting in the way! Oh, uh, what a me- What? Uh, did anyone just see the random pet matrix over that- Why is he- What is going on? Hold on. There's- There's like a pet just sliding around behind me. Can I help you? Like, is this guy different than all the other pets, Alex? Is this like some kind of- it's kind of like some sort of su oh, he's not dying. What is this? Okay. Wow! <laughs> it just RKO'd the whole insurgent. He just he just one tapped me. <laughs> Who is this? There's literally rockets, explosions, warthogs, helicopters, just you know roadblocks and and oh god and police vehicles, and then there's just some random dude in a tank top that elbow smashed my vehicle. Whoa! What is happening? <laughs> you didn't tell me that the tank was gonna spawn inside of my glove box. Mm. Just another day on the channel. Yeah, I always love it when I, uh, you know, order a tank from Amazon and then it comes early. There's like 30 of them! What are you supposed to do? Oh my god, there's like 10 tanks. It's like a flock of geese, but it's a flock of tanks. Mm. Didn't know that tanks ran in herds. Do I get like any kind of warning or anything before the tanks start showing up? Is it, is it, is it programmed right over here? Because this seems to be where they always kind of hang out at. All right, no tanks this time, thank God. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, so far, this, I mean, you know, except for the Warthog, this drive, this Sunday drive, oh my God! This Sunday drive has been very lackluster. I lied. I'm pretty sure I just got aerial strike. See what happens? You see what happens when you don't get off that cell phone? Next thing you know, the, the orbital defense systems of the United States Start dropping nukes on you. Oh no. Oh my god. Ah! Ah! What is this? <laughs> Why is there missiles? What is going on with the ward? <laughs> Guess what? Sticks the landing. <laughs> what? Who is this? Is that Jesus? Is that what that is? The guy who just teleports behind me and then flips my tank over? Well, my, 
my insurgent over. Oh, there's Jesus. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. Anymore. Like a fine wine. The 5,000 stars had to age. And now that they have, I'm kind of wishing that I would have chosen the cheap wine. Keep your tanks to yourself. I died and I don't even know how it happened. This is the run. Already off to, oh wow. I was gonna say, I'm already off to a good start. I'm pretty sure they're shooting cluster bombs at me now or something. I don't even know. If anyone sees a dude in a, in a, in a tank top, just let me know. Okay, this is good. This is good. The guy that was supposed to be manning my gun the whole time, I'm pretty sure just jumped at, did he just duplicate? Is he jumping out of the car every couple of seconds? He is, look at him. He's like, no more gray. <laughs> the tank. Okay, but we're doing good. Through the water, out through the broken wall, and then finally where we're supposed to go, the custom shop. All right, so what are you gonna do? Airbrush me to death? Everything else in this game's trying to kill me. I got bullet holes all over me. I don't even, I don't know if they're recent or what. It's ready. Your favorite color. Is it gray or pink? I've got a couple of favorite colors. What is it? If it's a deer, oh. I feel like there's less armor on this thing. This isn't really an upgrade. I mean, all right. Is there like a teleporter here? What do you get inside and you teleport and then? Oh my God! Criminal, could you give me a different license plate? But it doesn't matter because we've got a winner! And it lands right inside of the grave. I guess this is where I belong. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Till next time, stay foxy and much love.